Ooh. What's up guys, welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we're uh, going to be role playing as Engine 51 from the Chicago Fire Department. Uh, I've been kind of customised uh, my own kind of fire truck. So uh, today we're back at uh, LSPD4, back for another video on the channel. Today we're playing as Engine 51 from the Chicago Fire Department. We're going to have some fun today from uh, the some coastal callouts, or not coastal callouts, fire callouts on uh, LSPD4. So we have everybody set to go. All we need now is uh, our crew, which I'm gonna spawn in. And we should be ready to go. So guys, I'm gonna make like a new series. Uh, we're gonna be doing LSPDFR from now on. We're gonna be doing like some fire callouts, stuff like that. Let's just get three dudes here. Uh, let's go add them into our engine. So we're ready for callouts, warp into vehicle. Let's warp them into passenger. Thank you. Uh, let's go up here. So, guys, I have my uh, crew here. We're ready to go at the station. So, uh, we're going to be patrolling kind of the city, or we're going to wait for dispatch to give us a call out. So, we have our three dudes here. We're all ready to go. We have Cruz, uh, Casey, and Mouch, I think. They're not the people from the. Uh, in fifth one, but we'll go with it. So, I uh, hope you enjoyed today's episode. It's gonna be a pretty fun one. I haven't kind of played this PDF for in a while, especially fire call outs. I haven't played that in a while, but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and tell dispatch that we're available. Alright, we're all available. So, let's just wait on for a call, I guess. Hopefully, we get one soon. So, guys, we have all our crew ready, rolling the engine, ready to set to go. So, we're gonna go ahead and respond to engine 51. Responded to the house fire down the road. So let's go. I think it's down at Franklin's, like, aunt's house or something. I haven't played this pretty far in a while. I kind of like this fire truck skin as well that I made. It originally said Engine Company 50, but I changed it to 51 to make it from the actual show. Conduct the primary search. People may still be inside. Copy that dispatch. Show engine 51 on scene. Let, let's get a hose line. Or the uh, cannon, or whatever it's called. Let's try and knock down some of the outside fire before we enter the structure. The water gun, or the deck gun. From this truck. I kind of like this truck as well. We have a uh, truck 81. Kind of like a custom model, and we have a squad tree rescue truck so we're going to be doing like three kind of episodes we're going to be doing one with 81 today's uh, episode is with engine 51 and uh we're going to be doing another one with them with squad three and then we're probably going to do like a, a video with all three of them responding to a big call like a hazmat call or something it's gonna be pretty fun but anyway let's try and knock down some of this fire it's a hefty structure fire also, we have a uh, fire department backup if we need them. We can just call them in through the dispatch or the uh, menu. Flames kind of hard to get to, but anyway, let's like slow down traffic here. Let's try and knock down some of these roof flames. So it's going to be a bit risky fire, but uh, we'll try like uh, conduct it or condemn it. I'm not really sure what to say. These flames are kind of hard to get to. I hope uh, my mic is not too like echoey or something. Or my PC because my PC is very loud at the moment because of the fan. Let me just get an aerial view. Oh, no, I can't. Let's just continue spraying with the deck gun then. And try to knock down some of the flames on top. Alright, let's go ahead and pack up here. I'm gonna go ahead and hook up to a hydrant, so uh, let's go ahead and do that. I splood like the Atlantic and we're going down like the Titanic. I splood like the Atlantic and we're going down like the Titanic. I splood like the Atlantic and we're going down. So guys, we've hooked up the hydrant, uh, it comes with this fire truck as like an add-on or something like that. So we have a hydrant hooked up for a water supply. So let's go ahead and get our gear on here. 
Our truck seems to be uh, kind of bugged out. But let's go ahead and get our turnout gear on. And let's go rush in and see what we can do with this fire. Let's see if we can conduct it. Let's just, uh, get some of these outside flames out. So it doesn't kind of spread through the grass and cause like a brush fire. There we go. We have some people on us. I'm gonna get a call for backup from the police so we don't get shot at. Whoa! Chill out, buddy. There we are. I'm just got our helmet back on. But anyway, let's try uh, get the rest of this fire out without being disturbed. I'm gonna go ahead and call for backup. I don't know. Back. Oh dear. Backup needed in Strawberry. Just in case we get shot at, we have uh, some kind of police assistance. Roger that. We're on our way. There we are. Back up here. Oh no, no mind. It's on the way. So we have to guard these. She can't pull up. Anyway, let's go ahead and enter the structure. So we're gonna have to saw down the door. Next thing we had a saw in our back of our engine. Let's go ahead and get this the door down so we can get inside and conduct the fire and see what we're dealing with. There we are. So we have the fire out. Whoa, we have a lot of fire to condemn. Let's go ahead and put away our saw. I don't know why the structure is like not loading, but yeah, it's great. Uh oh. Alright, we're back outside. Seems like the fire has been locked down. Fire is the just called for. Copy that dispatch. Let's go ahead and turn off our CBA tank here. Let's go wrap up our engine. And let's just do a second research, first of all. Just to make sure this fire is completely gone from the building. Let's get a sawzall on this. Just to try to bust down this door. Just to see what we're dealing with. Hopefully it's not that much damage like done to the structure. Hopefully our engine company saved it. Brilliant Right, so now we're inside, we can see what we're dealing with. We need damage in here. Seems like the fire didn't, uh, wasn't big enough to kind of spread in here. So we should be good to go. I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the hydrant here. And uh, we're going to go ahead back to quarters. So we have the hydrant wrapped up, we should be good to go. Let me go ahead and head back to the station. Let's go ahead and head back to the base. And wait for another call out. Oops. Not the best driver and keeper of most in this game. That was a kind of tough call. Bit hard to handle, but we managed. Let's go ahead and show uh, dispatch show engine 51 available. Alright, let's go ahead and head back to quarters. Traffic is back to normal. Copy that. I'm sure what's wrong with these fire trucks. It's kind of weird. Let me pack up right here then. Just wait for another call out. So we're back up this. I'm going to go ahead and get our gear off here. Just go ahead and put back on our bunker gear while we're waiting. We have a cop here that showed up out of nowhere and he's just taking a picture. That ain't right. Hope you like the fire truck dude. So, uh, dispatch, uh, Ninja 51, we're available for any calls. Alright, the train has passed, so, clear to go, I guess. Let's just go ahead and go. Run away, people. Gotta get to that vehicle crash. Or accident. I don't know why they would call an engine company out to a vehicle fire or crash. Do you usually call a rescue squad or a ladder company or truck company? I don't really know why they call an engine. But we're here to help. They call this out for a reason, I guess. Engine 51, ETA 30 seconds away. Yeah, let's just go ahead and pull up here. This tank cleared a little bit so the uh, train doesn't hit us. 
Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and grab the saw. Let's head over and see what we're dealing with. Might need an ambulance. Alright, let, let's get the saw. Or this door off. Not the saw. Hopefully he's not unconscious, but uh, we might need to call a paramedic. Let's get an ambulance. Ambulance. Anyway. Assistance get these doors off as well. Alicia see if we've been here and it's in the car. Dispatch, I need an ambulance to a Ellison Island or Elysian, I don't know if it's a that way no there's ambulance fast response time but yeah let's get this uh, door off and let's get this guy out let's get this one off too no I guess it just fell out Alright, uh, paramedics, you can work away. I might go ahead and call vehicle insurance. We need a tow service. Alright, tow service is on the way. Yeah, it was kind of wise to stand clear of the train. I knew it was going to come eventually. But, uh, let's get tow service down here. Tell us out. We might need a patrol unit as well, just to give a statement. Let's just, let's just get a state patrol Backup unit. Uh, Island. I don't think they could save him. Copy dispatch. We'll assist. Fell from a height. He must have um, kind of fell off the bridge or something. But I'm not sure how he fell off the bridge if he was in a car. But he's unfortunately the paramedics couldn't save him. That's unfortunate. Might need a corner unit. Assistance required in Elysian Island. That's unfortunate. We lost one. I guess you can't save them all. And that's the thing where, like, uh, young people in schools, especially if you pull the fire alarm, you never know if it's really serious. You know? So the fire department don't really know. So they, like, respect the, the fire alarm as if it was a real call. So they'd be, like, full gear, full action, ready to fight the fire. But they won't really know, like, what caused it. Or if it's a fake fire or not. But you can't save them all, I guess. But anyway, uh, NG51 to dispatch. We're code 4 here. We are code 4. Copy that. NG51 to dispatch. We're going to head back to quarters. We can give a statement. Oh, well, yes, we're also playing as Lieutenant Herman from uh, Chicago Fire. That's where we're playing it today. Let's go ahead and head back to quarters here. Hope you're enjoying this episode so far, guys. Really put a lot of work into it. It's fun in episode 3. We're gonna come back with the episodes like soon enough. And I'm probably gonna make a new intro on soon enough about Chicago Fire. As if, like, my last, like, proper video that I posted was, uh, like a Chicago Fire theme song. So it might make an intro, uh, intro, not an entrance. Uh, intro out of it or at some stage, but yeah, edge of 51 to dispatch. We're gonna head, head back to quarters. The scene is secure. Fortunately, we couldn't save them all, but I guess it's down the line of work. Can't save all of them. Let's go ahead and here try beat the train. I'm gonna whack on my turn, so uh, we're allowed to cut traffic lights heading back to quarters. But let's go ahead and beat this train here. We just about beat it. Alright, we can whack him off. Beep beep. Whoops. I'm not the best driver on keyboard and mouse, but... I guess we did what we did with. So, yeah. Taxi, need you to kind of move. I'm backing up. The fire truck here. But, yeah. So guys, I think I'm going to do one more call out, and then we're going to go ahead and call it episode. It's been a pretty good episode so far. Oops, didn't mean to come back. But yeah. Let's go ahead and turn off the sirens. Or, or hazmat lights. Wait, that turns on the secondary lights as well? I never knew that. Anyway, we're back at Pace Dispatch. Let's go ahead and back, get back into our, our kind of gear here. I'm ready for a call out. Alright, we're back. 
station, we're at the Davis Fire Department. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, speak with these guys for a second. Just tell them that we had a rough call. What's up, guys? Yeah, it was a pretty rough call. Uh, that was unnecessary. Bruh. Ah! I'm friends with you. Why are you hitting me? I'm sorry, but I gotta put out my gun. Is that Lieutenant Casey and Herman? Yeah, it is. <laughs> Why are they here? But anyway, uh, we're gonna wait for a call here. On fire. All right, we've got a report of a vehicle fire at La Mesa or La Mesa. Let's go ahead and respond to that. Let's go ahead and get on our gear here. I'm good to go. I don't know why the truck is bouncing. Alright, let's get in. Let's go ahead and respond. So we have a vehicle fire. NJ51, ETA, 5 minutes from the scene. I kind of like this iron, so the American iron. Pretty nice. As you can see, we kind of have custom ambulances from the Irish Emergency Services. And we also have a custom, like, uh, Gardaí Care, which is Irish Police. Or, uh, cops or whatever they are in America. Or in England. In, in England, they're police, but in America, they're like cops or something. But anyway, let's try to get to this, uh, vehicle fire. See what we can do. Apparently, we're on scene, but I don't see a car on fire. Okay, guys, this bus just changed the location. It was kind of, uh, they got the location wrong. But it's good we have a new location of the actual vehicle fire. So go ahead and respond. I like the horn too, the horn's very good. So we have a Zentorno on fire. I'm gonna go ahead and stand back here. Whoa! I thought he got like tumbled away or something. Let's get this vehicle fire out. With a deck gun. Hopefully, we can get out. I'm gonna go ahead and stop traffic too. So, the traffic's not a problem. I'm gonna go ahead and get out. See what we're dealing with here. Luckily, there's no one inside, but uh, let's just get an extinguisher in case there's any gas leaks. We should be good to go. Then I'm gonna go ahead and call tow services for this thing. Call vehicle tow service, flatbed. Let's get traffic control. Assistance required on a popular street. Dispatch, we're code 4 here. Fire's out. We are code 4. Copy that. I guess we're gonna head back to the station. Right, let's head back to base. There's another Irish kind of guard care. They're up against. It's kind of cool. We're gonna cut into this line. Dispatch, uh, this is NG51, Lieutenant. We're gonna head back to quarters. I'm gonna go ahead and whack on the siren here. Just to skip the traffic. Firefighters, I don't know if they're allowed to do this, but we're gonna do it because we're special. Whoa! Uh, that truck might have a problem. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and report that when we get back. That uh, truck is missing a tire. Let's we'll get post hours for it. That Mini Cooper, whatever it was, was so close to hitting us. I'm not sure what that car is called, but it was so close to hitting us. Alright, let's head back to the quarters here. I guess these fire trucks aren't in the way, so we'll just go ahead and pull up. Like so. Me babe. Bro, why are you in my lane? Alright, we're all packed up. 
Ready to go. I'm gonna go ahead and get my gear back off. So guys, I think that's been a long episode for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. We're gonna go ahead and end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed today's uh, Inter 51 Chicago Fire Mod in uh, LSPDFR. If you did, make sure to smash like and subscribe if you're new. Also, turn post notifications on. And yeah, we'll see you in the next one. See, see ya.